More cutscene. Oh, it's a full screen cutscene cut as well. Temple Guardians. You're new. Do I get to fight them? No, stop. We are on your side. Eh, not really. Um, do not fear. You face no danger here. Oh. You are a human. You look so different to how I remember. Maybe because we were born of monkeys. Hello. Um, end of the Great Wars. What, the God Wars? Now I was summoned here to build the defenses. Very long time ago. Uh, there are no years here. Just peace and quiet. A name. Uh, I suppose I'm last before the life of me. I cannot remember. I haven't spoken to another living creature. Okay. I remember you. What? As I do. A younger you. Like many. Oh god, these guys are so old. Okay, you are a guardian. We were friends. Before Cress. Cress. What kind of a name is that? It's good to see you, real living creatures. Hooray! I have been following your progress. Continue. Where else is there to go? The last route. The room is a barrier before the center. This room is the barrier before. The last barrier before the center. We must defend from here. However, if you we are to win this battle, you must first embrace your destiny. Guthix has great plans for you. Hmm. Please approach the shrine behind me. Let us let us see Guthix's will. Okay, let's go. Uh, apparently, there's a strange map. Don't know what that means, but okay. As you approach the well, the wall, you feel Guthix calling you to prove yourself as a true Guthixian. <laughs> oh boy. Okay. You find a world. Okay, so so apparently, like everything has like a twenty-five percent chance, twenty-five percent increase in chaos order, good or evil. Um, I would use the thing. Ah, oh, screw it. Let's just let's just wing it. We'll just wing it. Um, you find a world without balance. Chaos triumph, triumphs and violence is rife. Cool. Naragi, inhabitants of this world, find fight over limited resistance. What is your first action to bring balance? Let's introduce more resources. Okay. The violence is reduced. Some settlements begin to spread, spring up. You sense rumbling. The volcano is about to explode. What do you do? Stop the disaster. Okay. The disaster is avoided. Okay, cool. Council of Naragi is are gaining popularity to rule the world. The world they would bring rules of honor and justice to Oops. Oh well. Council begins to use harsh tactics as to become elected. Their sense of honor becomes tainted. <laughs> Over the next few years, sinister disease becomes evident in some areas. Uh, I say quarantine. Okay, I've gone way too high on the order and good. Your actions were too strict. You must achieve balance. Oh, God. Okay, you know what? Screw it. We're going to use the guide. Oh, God. Okay, come on. <clears throat> Alright, so... Let's start off with... Let's start off with order and... Order and good next. Uh, fully back her. Wait, what do you actually do? Oh, this is about a volcano. Volcano, volcano, volcano. Do nothing. Let HR take its course. All right, next one. Uh, over the next. Okay, some sort of disease. Over the next few years, a sinister disease. Uh. Um. Okay, I'm gonna take a risk here and say stop. Uh, wait, wait, no, this is the disease one. Where is it? Uh, da, 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 da. Okay, I'm gonna just, I'm gonna say encourage the Naraki to take care of themselves. Soon, a young warlord. Okay, something, something, warlord. Uh, we're gonna encourage the Naragi to choose a more peaceful leader. Hooray! Your actions are harmonious. You have shown understand. <laughs> Not really, but. Alrighty. You have passed the test. Let us see what Guthix has in store. The hell was that? 
Yeah, the hell was that? Gothix has given you his blessing. He has chosen you as one of his creatures, guardian of Gothix, honor and deed. Hooray! Except I'm like wearing armadillo clothes. What was that? They're, they're breaking it. They're breaking through. Where are those droid cars? Okay, we are completely. You are not prepared. Anyway, go on. <sighs> completely unprepared. Yada yada yada. What do you propose we? What what who do, what do you propose we prepare? <laughs> We are sitting in the open. We have no organization. What can we do in the face of such determination? I must agree. I, I must agree. I fear we will be fighting. A dude, you, 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 you're death, dude. Just touch whoever shows up and that's it. Uh, I've had it with you guys and your salty ass attitude. Did I just point at them? It's no use falling apart with the enemy at our doorstep. Okay. If we didn't, if we don't believe we can win, then we have no choice. We must believe in ourselves. Believe in ourselves. Okay, rein. Oh, hang on. Is there is there a particular like reason to choose anything? Uh, after a short chat, you'll need to drag. Okay. Um. <sighs> protecting the edicts appeal to groups. Highlight the gruesome outcome if the group doesn't defend my ourselves. What do you think will happen if we just give up? There's no running from this. <laughs> if we surrender, they will stand. They'll come here and slaughter us. Ha 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 ha! Which option do you prefer? Uh... And besides, you got me. Does the power of Gothic? Does the Gothic grant me power for no reason? Follow me, and we will taste victory. You follow me and my friggin' armadillo battle staff. I mean, hello. I've got this, dude. I mean, you know, we'll be fine. Let's stand and fight. For, oh, this is a shit speech. You could literally replace. You, you might as well replace this speech with like Aragon's speech at the for the last battle of um, Mordor, like at the last bit before you know before Sauron dies. Spoiler alert. Uh, that would have been a far better speech. Anyway, my creatures inform me the points. The points of breakthrough will be in the storage ring wings. What that one? Okay, there are four of them. And the enemy would reach them first. Okay, there are smaller rooms than this. They are small rooms. If we defeat the enemy there, they will make we will make a better defense. Okay, let's go. You can take the create. You can take the creations to one. Fiora, Volta. Okay, the death. You're on your own. <laughs> death. You're on your own, buddy. Souls, but you are death. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. Now just decide who will defend where. My creations can aid us there. They can hear the commotion. Okay, provided. Oh, uh, sure. You can. You can you can use that alongside your knowledge of your own strengths to organize the defending teams. Okay then. Be aware the battlegrounds will be dangerous. If you make the wrong decision, you will be less effective in your defense. Okay, well what the hell is that? Whoever is coming through this way will be very big and slow, using their immense strength. Okay, to force their way through the rock, perhaps they don't have the intelligence to try the other way. Uh, sounds like there will be a lot of enemies breaking through here. The foul stench of undead enemies can be spelled. Whoever is leading these troops must have an immense talent to undermine death itself. Okay, so let's not put death there, I guess. That's the idea. No, we're not going to put death there. Uh, this is enemy sounds large, slow, and heavy, but they are using more than strength to break, break through. The impact, the impact of magic can be heard alongside demonic chanting, so they must have some intelligence. Okie dokie. Uh, whoever's coming here sounds small and nimble. They seem to only be using magic, so can be rest assured that they will have high resistance to magic used against them. Uh, their attacks sound extremely de de aggressive, as if they are beyond determined. Okay, Death is a fast and lone and skilled lone fighter. He would run circles around a large enemy. Okay, he uses he primarily uses his own discipline of ma magic, but is a capable melee component. Uh, sounds large. Impact of magic can be heard. Okay, well, so we'll definitely put death there as as it should be. Okay, excellent. No worries. So people are moving. Where the hell are you guys going? Um. Okay. Next one. Uh, Childish shot size means she can move very quickly and be well suited to a large, slow enemy. Theralix, on the other hand, although not experienced as a fighter, has a wealth of knowledge and can be used to outsmart less intelligent people. Okay. You don't have intelligence to go idiot. Very big and slow. Use their immense strength. Okay. I think. So, okay, so that's the reason why you want to throw these two over there. Awesome. Uh, Val Valuta and Fiara are both large creatures and slow movie fighters. They also have high magic resistance, so it'll be well against specialized in it. Something, something, something. Undermine death. No, something, something, something. They seem to only be using magic. Okay. 
Crest is no fighter, as he is slow and fragile. He will use his creations to undermine to fight for him. So we could match for multiple smaller enemies. He wouldn't be a match for anyone too physically strong. Okie dokie. All the wings are now def hang on, let me just check. So duh, 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 duh. Okay, yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Okay. All the wings are now defended. You may resign defenders as you see fit. Come when you come to me when you have finished. Uh yeah, we're good to go, man. Let's go. Yeah, must be sure. These battles will be deadly. If you make a little decision, you may even find yourself less Okay. Good decision will a good decision will certainly give you extra spirit in battle. Okay, you have a you you have until you enter the storage wing to change your mind. Okay. I am happy with the formation that we are ready. What are the, what are the other Goth what about the other Gothicians yourself? Sadly, away from the tears of Gothics. Oh, tears of Gothics. Oh, so that's where I've that's where I know this giant snake from. Okay, excellent. Sadly, away from the tears of Gothics, I have little prowess in battle. Uh, I would be more of a hindrance to help. Okay, similarly, my oh these damn humans. See, this is the same thing as Transformers Five, right? So you've got like so you've got. So you've got Cress, who's awesome, you've got, well, okay, maybe not this dude, but you've got, like, Chelda, who's, like, okay, cool. You've got Death, who, you know, Death. Uh, then you have the giant tortoise and, like, the scorpion dude. Awesome, like, super special characters who could use a lot of, like, um, uh, exploration in both their character and, like, as a thing that they can use. And yet, there's these damn humans! Damn useless Humans! Anyway, sadly my druid strengths do not lie in combat. We cannot accompany you into the wings. Ah! Oh, okay, we will remain here as the last line of defense. There is plant life in this room we can use to construct barriers and... Okie dokie! My druids can also provide aid to you. We will create cauldrons used to heal and empower you. Excellent! This is all the preparation we need. Alright then, let's bloody go, son! Let's go! Ah... Uh. Alrighty. Oh, he's ready. He's already. He's ready to go, man. He's ready to go. 